hey, next year is going to be the year of quantum. And this has been going on for about 15 years. Right now, we may be up to about 150 quantum bits. But imagine if you had a 150-bit computer. How much work could you do? Well, that's your storage, right? You know, you're like, wait, I need something bigger. And so what we're talking about here is Microsoft's promise to create a technology that could scale to millions of qubits or quantum bits on a single chip. Uh, but that's not what they're announcing. Uh, they don't have that right now. And right now, I think other companies have said, yeah, we can do about 150 uh, stable. But think about this. If you're using RSA, uh, what's your key length? Because if you're using an old, an old key link of 768 or 1024, maybe even 2048 uh, bits, is sometime in the next few years, quantum computing may be able to go ahead and split that thing into two. Well, you're not to worry about it now because you'll change when that happens. Your adversaries are already recording all of these conversations, the key exchanges. And granted, 99.9% .9 of what you say and do today would probably be of no use to anybody in five years from now. But if you happen to be logging into your Bitcoin wallet or you happen to be doing a national secret or something like that, it could still be valuable. So you ought to be moving to post-quantum crypto now.